All right, so I don't know if you can hear me um, over these massive waves here because of the ocean, but uh, I raced down here to try and see the sunset because, you know, the sun set 10 minutes ago, but I'm on the East Coast, so I tried to see the sunset on the East Coast, which, if you don't know math, the sun doesn't set on the East Coast. And there I was trying to see a sunset on the East Coast. So I guess my only hope is to wake up at 5 a.m. and try and see a sunrise before I leave tomorrow. But basically, I'm in Rhode Island. I was here for my brother's wedding these last few days. It was awesome. I'll show you some clips that I got that were Fuego, some Fuego clips. rocky little beach getting some shots with the new gimbal uh, testing it out this isn't like a this is a vlog all right this is my first official vlog I said it but this isn't a product review of the yeah it is okay but in this vlog I'm gonna be reviewing this gimbal it's a uh, Zion crane v2 I got it on eBay so if there's some problems it might not be the company that produces this drone could just be the guy I bought it from. So uh, let's test this out with some beach shots here on this beach before the sun goes away even more. But like I said, I'm probably gonna have to wake up early and get some more shots because it is already pretty dark and scary and spooky and there could be sharks. All right, we're gonna go explore this. Uh, I believe it's called a jetty or a getty or a something like that uh, because it looks cool over there and it's very rocky and very dangerous, which is perfect to do at nighttime like right now. But. Uh, this is a field test of the new Canon M50 that I got with the microphone and uh, my new gimbal. So this is, uh, I guess, a vlog field test, but we're gonna get some sick shots, make it super cinematic, put some cool music to it, and you can see whether or not you like this camera. That was a dark walk back. That was kind of scary, and I don't know what kind of wildlife is in Rhode Island, but what am I gonna say? Well, this is a vlog, so I can really talk about anything I want, right? That's the deal. Uh, I guess I'll talk about something that I just realized yesterday when I was filming my brother's wedding. I know a lot of people like have anxiety or stress about like vlogging in public, which is totally understandable, but if I could offer some words of wisdom, even though I'm, I'm still pretty bad at it, but what I realized is like, I, cause I don't want you to go out and buy a bunch of equipment or anything, but the more professional you look, the like more confident you feel, and like the less people will like judge what you're doing. Not that you should care what people think about what you're doing anyway. If you want to vlog, go ahead and do it. But I'm just saying like, cause I was walking through like a very nice venue for the wedding and I was like holding up a like gimbal and camera and everything and like people were looking whatever, but I'm wearing like a suit and I, I didn't care cause you kinda like, everyone's like, oh, like this is actually like a professional doing something legit. So I don't know, do with that what you will, but I'm just saying like the more professional you look, or maybe it's just like confidence, like if you dress nice, whatever, and if people think you're actually doing something legit, then maybe they won't care as much about what you're doing. What could I talk about? So I was just down at the beach doing a little test shot with the Canon M50, uh, some photography. 
uh, and I used the gimbal. I'm, I'm loving it so far. I used it for the wedding and I used it now. Yeah, that's all I have to say. Okay, bye. Also, uh, while we're in the way of like reviewing tech, I guess, this light is so dope. I got this, it's actually like fairly expensive, but that's because it does exactly what you need it to. This is a LED RGB light from Amazon that I just got. This is the first time using it in like a legit setting. So this is another vlog product review type deal. But this light right now is at half brightness because it's it might it's too bright. It's that good. It's literally too bright. And the coolest thing, you can literally Oh, that was the wrong button. Uh, you can change the color of the light. So if you want this is like a background, whatever. But this light is so sick. This is not just an excuse for me to drop an affiliate link in the description. However, I will be dropping an affiliate link anyway. So you can change the hue of the light. So if you want it more like of a blue, almost like industrial feel, or I like it warmer, so I go all the way there, because then it makes me look tanner. It's so good. It does everything you need to. I bought some dumb things in the last couple weeks that I hated or they might not work as well, or I don't think that you guys would like them, so I'm not gonna talk about them or link them in a vlog. But this is actually a light that's really good and something I'd use, and I'm using right now. I use, I'm using it right now, so I'll link this down below as well. All right, goodbye. Actually, let me just talk about one other thing, kind of the direction I wanna take this channel almost. I like doing vlogs, and I also like doing the product reviews that I did, so I think kind of a cool thing that we could do with this channel is, and I'm just spitballing here, you know? Maybe if we do like a vlog where we kind of test out new equipment in the vlog. So it's almost like a, you're watching like a starting YouTuber. I hate that expression, but a starting YouTuber like build out their setup and actually like explain each step of the way of improving the quality of their videos and stuff like that. So maybe that's just spitball, but that might be a direction we could take this. Uh, let me know down below if that would be something you'd like. Goodbye. Okay, so I just realized how not cohesive at all this vlog is, so uh, I, this is technically after the fact, but I'm going on a hike, and I'm going to go hike the Rhode Island Cliff Walk, whatever. Uh, plot twist, I don't make it to the end. <laughs> mask is impeding my breathing. If I fall off a cliff or I faint and you find just this camera with an SD card, you know it was the mask that did it, right?
my car all the way over there. And I have like 10 minutes left on the meter. It's time to run. Alright, I just finished the uh, the hike. I made it back to the meter with like two minutes left in it, so good on that. And as I walked up, there was like a tow truck towing a different car that was, I guess, here too long. So I kind of thought it, they were towing my car and I was gonna like freak out and punch someone. This pretty much wraps up the Rhode Island trip. I got like a five hour car ride back home, so probably gonna start that head out. Also, my back is so sweaty which you probably don't want to know. But I need to find water somewhere because I'm super parched. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe if you enjoyed. I really liked this type of content. I guess it's called vlogging. So maybe I'll do some more vlogs in the future. I don't know. I Don't hold me to anything. Peace.